Welcome to Excel Campus. My name is John, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to search a data validation list or an in cell drop down list. So, in this cell right here, I have a data validation list with a long list of values here. There's a lot of fruits and vegetables in this list here, and sometimes it's hard to scroll through these long lists to find the item we're looking for. And unfortunately, there's no way to directly search this list in Excel, there's no built in way to do this. There are a few fancy uh, workarounds you can use. To to create uh, formula-based data validation lists that'll help with this search, uh, but you have to do a lot of setup work in each list that you wanna create that for. So I've created an add-in. It's an absolutely free add-in that you can use. Uh, and once you install it here, you'll see the Excel Campus tab of the ribbon appear right here. And then you'll see this list search button appear right here. And clicking that list search button will open this very simple form right here. It has a drop-down menu in it. And when you click that, you'll see that the uh, list has been loaded into this list right here. So the list that's the data validation list that's in the cell has been loaded right here into the form. And we can use this box here to search. So one of my favorite fruits are peaches. So if I start typing the word peach, you can see that the list is narrowed down right here for any words uh, that contain the phrase P-E-A right there. So it doesn't necessarily have to start with the word. Uh, here is peach right here. So you can use the keyboard or the mouse to select the item you want. I'll select peach there and then I can hit the enter key on the keyboard or I can press this button right here to input that value in the cell right there. And then you can see that it also selects the cell right below that. Uh, so you can continue to search here and add items. So now I can continue with my search. If I, Another uh, vegetable I like are sweet potatoes. So if I start typing the word sweet potato, you can see I don't have, or I have sweet potato here in the list. I never would have found Cuban sweet potato uh, scrolling through the list there. So again, this makes it very easy uh, to find items you're looking for. Just select that item and you can hit enter and that'll enter it right in the cell there. And list search also has some optional uh, features here. So if you click this menu button, you can see that you can uh, sort the list from A to Z, ascending order. You can also sort it in descending order, or this is the original order here. Uh, we can also get some info about the list. So this particular list here has 164 items in it. And then you can also change the order. So after you hit enter, or press the input button right here, you can change the order of the next cell that's selected. So you can select down one cell, you can go right one cell, uh, do nothing at all, or just close the form. So that's a basic overview of how list search works, and it'll work on any data validation list in any workbook that you already have. So you don't have to make any changes to your workbooks. You can just open this form and start searching the list. And you don't even have to have uh, data validation cells. So these cells here that we opened the form on have this data validation. If I jump over to this other sheet, you can see I just have a sheet here with a list of data and there aren't any uh, data validation cells anywhere in this list. So if I was to just select a cell here and open list search, it's going to automatically uh, find all the unique val values in this particular column here in column D and then list them right here in the box. And of course the search works here as well. So if we were looking uh, for the name Ann, we could just start typing the word Ann and you can see all the names appear right here that have the word Ann in them. So you don't even need to have uh, data validation in your cells. List search can work just about anywhere in your worksheet. And of course the options uh, work here as well. If you wanna sort the list here in ascending order, we could see the list in ascending order, descending order, and uh, this is just based on the search we have. So if we want to clear the search, we can do that. And then again, see the list in ascending order or descending order and uh, change the direction as well. So list search again is a, just a great handy little tool to help you search data validation lists or any list of data in Excel. And it's a free download from Excel Campus. You can get it at excelcampus.com and I'll put the link uh, to that download page below this video in the description section. So if you have any questions at all, please leave a comment below and I'll be happy to help answer them. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you soon.